What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you follow Teen Mom 2 Star Chelsea, who's got, I have some really exciting news to share with you guys. But before I get into that, quick shout out to the coldest water bottle. They offer these in all different colors. They are insulated and they keep your drinks cold for 36 plus hours. They have amazing reviews and I absolutely love mine. My children have really taken to this. My son, he asked me just a while ago before I got on stream, he said, Mom, don't forget to order me one. So these are a big hit in my family and I would not promote this if I do not enjoy it myself. You guys, if you want to check these out, if you wanna get some for yourself, your kids, your little football players, check the link in the description box below. Also, there is a code LBASS. You can get 10% off your first order. Check this out, you guys. So Chelsea Huska, as you guys know, she fell in love with Adam Lynn back when they were just children and it took her a really long time to get over him. Then she finally met her Prince Charming Cole DeBoer. And now a lot of people will, you know, talk about his little baby boys, but I love Chelsea and Cole together. I think they are the perfect couple. I mean, before Chelsea met Cole, like she had her little baby boys. So it's just so ironic that she meets a man that even has like little soft, somewhat of like a toddler voice. Some people talk about the fact that it's annoying, but I think it's kind of cute. I don't know. So Chelsea had Aubrey with Adam. Aubrey is now 10 years old. Chelsea and Cole have a three-year-old little boy named Watson. They have a one-year-old little girl named Lane, and they just announced they're gonna be having a new baby come 2021. Yes, early 2021, Chelsea will be giving birth to her and Cole's third child together. Now, let's see. Early 2021, we are in the eighth month. So, early 2021, January, February, that could mean that she's already three to four months pregnant. Yeah, so she did not say how far along that she was. She did not reveal the gender of the baby either. I don't even know if she knows the gender of the baby. However, what I do know is that most celebrities do not announce their pregnancy, at least until they're after their first trimester, which is 13 weeks, 12 or 13 weeks. So I'm expecting that she is at least out of her first trimester. And nowadays you can find out the sex of your baby pretty early on. Back when I had Paris, you had to be like 20 weeks. But when I had Kennedy, it was 16 weeks. So in the next few weeks, I think we're gonna know the, the gender of her baby. That's just my assumptions, okay? Chelsea actually announced this today, but it depends on when I edit this and get this up. Uh, it may be uh, yesterday. She announced it on Wednesday on her social media account, and she announced this in the sweetest way, you guys. I think it was really cute. As you guys know, if you follow her, uh, Chelsea and Cole bought a big lot of land, like out in the middle of nowhere, and they're building their dream home on this land. And on some of the um, wall in the house, they wrote Cole, Chelsea, Aubrey, Watson, Lane, baby. And below that, a little heart. In the caption, she wrote, one more DeBoer, what? Coming early 2021. That is awesome. Now, as you guys know, Chelsea actually had Lane um, on her 27th birthday. And back in 2018, Chelsea opened up on Twitter about a condition that she had called mastitis. And mastitis is an infection in the breast tissue, which causes a lot of pain, swelling, redness. Chelsea took to Twitter to say, this is the first day that I don't feel like I'm dying. I never knew how horrible mastitis was, and I never want to go through that again. Now, like I said, according to the Mayo Clinic, mastitis is an inflammation of the breast tissue that sometimes involves an infection. The inflammation will result in a lot of pain, swelling, warmth, redness. You may also get like the fevers and chills. I'm sure now Chelsea, pregnant with baby that that may be a thought in her head like oh no I really hope I don't get this I don't know what the chances of her getting it again if she got it after baby lane but hopefully we're gonna pray for a a healthy baby a safe delivery and a safe recovery um for Chelsea and as you guys know as well Kale just had her baby baby number four so you guys keep these team mom girls in your thoughts and your prayers with their babies their bundles of babies right um, I love Cole and Chelsea together. You guys head over to Chelsea's page and show her some love and congratulations for one more DeBoer. Oh,